Sup, so, uh, Jonathan Snook just tweeted me and he said, I still wish Chrome Web Inspector uh, could tell me what DOM node was being painted. Um, and so this is uh, when DOM nodes get repainted. Um, it happens all the time. Uh, he'd like some insight into what actual element uh, is getting painted. Um, and I'm going to tell you how. Okay, so uh, it's kind of a long answer. But the first thing is that there is a command line flag that tells this information to you. Um, and so this is over on Peter Beverloo's uh, site. He has, he has a little script that crawls, crawls all the command line flags for Chrome and lists them out. And the one that we're most interested in is show paint rects. And show paint rects uh, visibly render a border around paint rects uh, in the web page to help debug and study painting behavior. Good. So let's do that. I'm going to close uh, my Chromium and I'm going to run Chromium uh, with that. So to run Chromium or Chrome with a command line flag, uh, it takes a little bit of jumping to get to the executable and then you pass it the, the flag like this. I'm just going to fire that off. If you Google for show paint rec or Google for Chrome command line flags, there's more information on how to do that. Okay, cool. Now you'll see these little faint boxes around these um, around these table cells. And that's because as I'm hovering, the text color is changing and so the elements need to be redrawn, um, repainted, because they are changing their visual state. Um, I'll go back over here and you can see the same behavior happens on this, but whereas the text that does not change does not get repainted, so there's no board around it. Uh, Google News is another good example because it has some nice interactivity. Um, you can kind of adjust things. You can actually see on this one, um, as I do this, uh, the right hand column over here actually gets a repaint. So there might be a reflow going on here that is adjusting the layout of the entire rest of this column and the right column at the same time. So that might be a potential area to, uh, to find an optimization. Uh, looking over, this is a, a visualization done by Ben Allman and it's manipulating um, elements like div elements or something like that um, and drawing with them and it looks pretty cool. Um, oh, and the last thing that I wanted to show was uh, this. So in um, the Chrome Dev Tools under Timeline, so you can record a timeline. I'm going to do that now. Cool. And I'll just zoom in on an area. You'll see timer fired paint. And now this is actually somewhat new in Chrome Dev Tools. So there was paint before. And if I hover over a paint, it tells me the dimensions of that paint. Uh, so 280 pixels, 177 pixels. Um, so now, if you notice in the top, um, there's a solid red border, kind of big, that represents um, the element that got painted. So, um, so now we can actually see visually what the actual area was that got the repaint, um, and we can associate this with timeline data, which kind of ties together script and, and the rendering thing. Um, I think that, so the timeline is pretty helpful for this. I think show paint rex is also pretty awesome. And this is a, a Chrome ticket to get show paint rects in as a native feature inside the DevTools. So uh, 71035, um, star that if you want to watch, um, because I know that the team would love to make this expose a little bit easier so that everyone doesn't have to run a command line flag. So follow that if you want. And, um, and that's my answer to that question. Yeah.